Hi right, folks, uh, this is the first video in a, lot, in a series about dollar sign expansion. So I'm just going to get cracking um, and show you how it works. So what we'll do is we're going to first create a press control alt v and create a variable for we call a v quantity and our expression will be some quantity and then we're going to use the the dollar sign expansion so we're going to divide it by dollar one and you'll see what what we can do with that so we click ok and then create a text object and we'll say equals v quantity we'll just expand that with a dollar sign and now if we click ok you'll see it's not giving us a result back but because we put in dollar one in, in the in the variable we can open and close in parentheses within the v quantity variable and then put in our number that we so dollar one would represent in this case we're going to divide the sum of quantity by 100 so we click ok you can see it gives us our total amount which is 25,094 divided by 100 gives you 250.94 and again it just means if we, if we want to change this we can change it to uh, 10,000 and then it'll go to 2.5094 so you can use a if we go back into the variable we can change this instead of divided by dollar one we can say minus dollar one so we click ok we now get uh, 25,000 minus 10,000 which gives us 15,000 um, again we could change it again we could say We could say multiply, and then within here we can say instead of ten thousand, this one becomes two. So we can reuse the v quantity and just change the, the just change the um, the parameter. So in this one we're using the parameter of ten thousand, um, in this variable we're using the parameter of two, and you can keep going. So for example, we could say some quantity multiplied by dollar one minus dollar two so now if we went to this we could say comma twenty five thousand and this one we can say comma three so you see it's basically it's let me just have a quick look at the variable. So what we're doing is we're multiplying by dollar one and then we're minus dollar two. So this one uh, we're going to multiply by two, which is twenty-five thousand and ninety-four by two, and then we're saying comma three, we're going to minus three. So we actually said minus forty thousand and click apply see it's gone down to 20,000 so you can keep going with the, the number of uh, parameters that you want to add to the variable v quantity just just a quick introduction I'm going to have a lot more videos coming up on dollar sign expansion I hope that gives you an idea on, on, on how to use it and I'll see you next video cheers